Hey Sarah, good afternoon. This is Ashley. So I wanted to go over a couple of things here. I want to talk about some services that we offer and also talk about what you could be looking for and so on. So to start, I went and Googled Plumber San Diego, California. And this area here is what's called the Map Pack. And excluding the sponsored ads, um, the top three listed here are the ones that receive a lot of work because they're super easy to find and they're listed right away. So the way you can get yourself into the, these top three is by first having a Google Business Profile. Second, it's filling it out as much as possible with the name, hours, phone number, photos, just making sure everything is filled out. And three, putting your business name, address, and phone number into as many online directories as possible. And directories are things like Yelp and Yellow Pages and Angie's. And having your information in those online directories are really going to help power your profile. And websites listed below here, these are what's called the organic search. And the same things apply. You want to be on the front page and ideally within the top three so people can find you. That's not including Yelp and Angie's list. That's literally ones that are posted that are here that you can just click on and go to the website. So that's what the difference is. So the main thing that you want to do with your website is you want to have about 1,500 to 2,000 words on the home page. And this is for a few reasons. And the first reason being is that if your competitor has about a thousand words, then you definitely want to have at least 1500 words because you want to beat them, beat out the competition, um, how much content that they have. So the second reason is that Google has what we call crawlers that go through and they read the content of the website and try and figure out what services your business offers what areas you serve, and the more content that you have on the site, the more of an expert you're going to look like in Google's eyes. So within the content, you want to have keywords, and keywords are things that people are searching for. So for example, how I googled Plumber San Diego, California, if you have Plumber San Diego, California all over your website, it's going to become really relevant for that search, and Google's going to be more willing to put your website higher to the top. So when you look at your website, it's really important that you have enough uh, content on there and the keywords throughout and it's really going to help your website rank. So looking at this, it looks like there's a great opportunity for more content to be able to, to um, have those uh, keywords throughout the, the information on there. All right, so I want to take a look at one of the competitors in the area and I have a paid program that I use and I put them in there just because I want to show you what you're up against, okay? So I pulled up Pick Plumbing. And so the, I also wanted to go over the UR and the DR ratings uh, because they're super important where you fall in the Google search results. And a UR rating is essentially a, a trust rating with Google and a DR rating is a power rating with Google. And so these numbers are looking at the overall site, like how powerful it is, how trustworthy it is. And the higher up that they are, the more powerful your site is and the better you're going to rank in the search results. And one of the ways you can increase these numbers is through a thing called a backlink. And all a backlink really is, is just a shout out from another website that's endorsing you. And they're sending a link back to your site through a clickable text. So what we can do is we can go through competitors backlinks, get those uh, for your website and then get additional ones as well. And so the last thing I want to talk about was the keywords in the content that I was kind of that I was referencing before. So for example, I wanted to show you what um, keywords that you know, Pick Plumbing is when it pop, when they type in certain keywords that um, which ones are popping up for this company. So the volume represents how many people a month are searching for specific keywords, and of course the keywords are what they're searching for. Um, so local plumbing company, 250 people are searching for that a month. Um, just kind of give it best plumber San Diego, 350 people look for that a month. Um, so that could be something that could be used. Plumbing services, San Diego, 100 people are searching for that a month. Um, if you're emergency plumbing, that's 200 people that are looking for that a month and so on and so on. So you get the idea that this, you know, this is a hefty number if you have, you know, certain keywords to pull, to put inside your content. But it's really important to get in front of these people. And if you're, if you can get in front of more people that are searching for those terms, the more that they're going to find you and the more people are going to call you and in turn the business you're going to land. So I hope this information was helpful for you just to kind of give you an idea. And I look forward to hearing from you and discussing any opportunities. So take care and have a great day.